Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. As usual, I'm back with another informative video for all my first time parents. I'm going to help you understand why your baby might be crying by explaining the six different types of baby cries. So let's get right into it. As parents, dealing with a crying baby can become very frustrating. And especially if you've gotten to the point where you're unsure why your baby is crying, this can leave you feeling helpless. So as I mentioned before, there are six types of cries and we're going to start with the first one being hunger. When your baby is hungry, they will start off with a low pitch cry with pauses in between. However, after each pause, the crying will get louder and louder until they're fed. Three ways that you can avoid your baby getting to that high pitch phase of crying, you can learn your baby's cues. Your baby will show signs when they're hungry. You can also create a feeding schedule for your baby as well as monitor what time you last with your baby so you can know when it's time for your baby to be fed. Next will be colic cries. Colic is when your baby cries for long periods of time with no specific or obvious reasons. This type of cry will be periodic outbursts of high pitched screams that will leave your baby breathless and start all over again. There are several things you can do to help relieve colic in babies. Try laying your baby on the tummy while you gently rub the back. Burp the baby. Take the baby for a walk. Give the baby a warm bath. Talk to your doctor or pediatrician about if they would recommend you giving your baby gripe water or gas drops. Or you could just cuddle your baby and comfort the baby until the crying subsides. The third reason baby might be crying will have to be discomfort. If your baby is uncomfortable, the baby will start off with a whining cry that will eventually become louder if the reason for the crying is not resolved. A few reasons why your baby might be uncomfortable could be a wet or dirty diaper, needing a change in position, baby feeling too hot or too cold, or your baby needs to be burped. The fourth type of cry will be sudden outbursts of high-pitched screams. This will occur if your baby is in pain. If you are concerned or if you think your baby is in ongoing pain, then you should take your baby to see the doctor. If your baby is at an age where they're teething, this could be the reason for the pain and more than likely, your doctor is going to prescribe for you to give your baby infant Tylenol suspension, also called acetaminophen. Babies will also cry if they're tired. This type of cry is a low pitch cry that is followed by rubbing of the eyes and the pulling of the ear. In order for you to avoid your baby becoming overly tired, you can create a sleep schedule for your baby that will allow your baby to have several naps throughout the day. Now the sixth and final type of cry will have to be because of boredom. Yes, babies do get bored and when they do, they'll start to whine on and off until they get some attention. Sometimes a change in environment, a change in toys, or just playing with your baby will resolve the crying. Now that you know the six different types of cries, your parental detective skills have heightened and you're now equipped with the information you need to recognize and resolve why your baby might be crying. If you liked this video and you found it helpful, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more mom and baby content. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you again in the next one.